The gunshot victim has been identified as Altaka Bill Chakwari, a son of Ashraf Chakwari and Margaret Atura, resident of Mulema village in Hoima West Division, Hoima City. Margaret Atura, the mother of the victim, says the driver of a Toyota Wish in reverse knocked a Toyota Ipsum car that had plain clothed people and one of them opened fire. Following the incident, she saw blood coming from the head of her baby, whom she had on her laps. Some of the eyewitnesses have explained that the officers in an Ipsam vehicle who had come to arrest occupants of a Toyota Wish car opened fire when the driver knocked their vehicle while trying to escape. <laughs> The father of the victim wants police to treat his son since he was innocently hit. So I don't know how can a, a government just help me to trace, at least maybe allocate the, 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 the root cause of that incident. So I'm just requesting for the government at least maybe to play their role so that we can at least maybe get the clear information and help me at least with the little so that my child can at least maybe be better than the way how he is. Innocent Kusima, the medical clinic officer at Destiny Medical Center where the minor is being hospitalized, has noted that the minor suffered a deep cut wound with the minor bone scratch. There was no perforation to the head. There was no perforation to the head. It was just sort of cut or superior, but it was full depth, with minor bone involvement, which was outer, not inside. So there was no crack going into the brain, into the head, nothing. The Albertine Region Police spokesperson, ASP Julia Sakiza Allen, has noted that the police regrets the incident. He has, however, not explained where the police will meet the medical expenses. The, the one who discharged the bread was, was his intention was to shoot the tires. But which tires, of course, on a, on a vehicle that was moving, it ended up now hitting the, 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 the rough surface and injured the kid. We cannot distance ourselves from them. We shall keep on also visiting them and see. Then, then we see how we can talk to them. But it was not intended. And we do apologize that whatever happened, was not intended to injure the kid. He has also explained that the officers continued to pursue the vehicle and impounded it after the occupants abandoned it in Kasingo village, Hoima West Division. Police has reported that there is an increased car theft in the region with eight cases registered in the last one month.